<laughs> so close, but so far. You you were on to something until you were. I was, I was like there, and then we crashed. Um, But yeah, just want to give a quick shout out to everybody watching on Twitch. Three, Big shout out to two, production, which is basically one, just Jed today. Go. Huge, killing it today. And uh, yeah, my co-caster, Osti, who's always fun to hang with. You guys don't even know. You guys don't even know what it's like. Well, you don't even know. Last time I got to cast this exchange between the two of these contenders, it was by myself at Unleash <laughs> the Beast. I was solo micing it for a hot minute before I walked out. Ooh. I was feeling good. Had a little bit of the party inside of me, and Ooh. it looks like Van is starting off with a little bit of C4 in his heart as MVD with a great back throw gets combination. That, gets that night popping, but gets it night popping right onto that C4. So unlucky there for Vin, and uh, gonna get a quick switch up uh, of tactics here, if you ask me. Is that C4? No, it's Kazuya Mishima. It's killed you in two hits. <laughs> uh, down one stock after after. Three stocking JoJo. I gotta think that he's gonna come out with some fire here. That was fire, Fuego movement indeed, but doesn't get the kill. And MVD just gonna probably live it out here very annoyingly. Uh, in esports, in my opinion, annoying is like such a good word to use, you know what I mean? Because there's right. so many things that aren't. Tear, like right, they're not broken. It's not. It's not bad. It's just annoying yeah. to deal with. And yeah. I, I'm not saying it in a bad way. I just think it's like one of the most overused, like most underused words, uh, because you know it's kind of got a negative connotation. But very annoying play coming from both of these players. Yeah, pestering. Yeah. A little bit of just getting underneath the skin. Like a grenade a exploding right in front of your face. That's Especially annoying, the, bro. For me, the annoying part of the grenade is the frame one. Yeah. Should be frame two, one to get it out, and one to pull the, the pin, pin yeah. at the fastest. But He's yeah. got a C4 stuck to him, but he up bees, gets the kill, and negates the damage. That was so... Oh, no, he doesn't. He still has it on him. <laughs> so pro until it wasn't. Yeah, that was cool. Uh, is counter doing something? Yeah, he got he got the Nikita to chill out for a minute. It was still yeah. seeking that heat, but it was able to prolong it long enough that there was no gas, but the uh, dash back into the up tilt. Crazy, man. Yo, that's the mix-up. Honestly, like, I, there was no mash from Vin. He got put to sleep, and then he was just the, sitting in center stage, so very easy for MVD to go ahead and go get that. But you see every hit from MV, uh, MVD. Every hit from Vin is met by a hit from MVD as a trade. Tries to go for another upbeat kill here now. That thing's got to be getting stale or getting close. Definitely going to be running out of the sequence, but so much explosion hitting Ven left, right, and center. MVD saying, cool guys don't look at explosions. I'm over here on my next grenade. Nikita out, trying to, he drops Nikita on the platform so he can't land platform. Then he grabs him, rolls into his boot. So crazy, man. MVD, what the heck, my guy? He wants that, he wants to face Sonics, I guess. Yeah, yeah, I mean, he. I don't think he's beating Sonics. I would love to see. Him. I have not seen him beating Sonics. Oh, that would have, be have you seen him beat Sonics? No, that would be. I, I, I too have never seen him beat Sonics. Yeah. Every time I ask anybody about, like, I, I always walk up to people. You know, you're trying to give them the positivity that you're always talking about, Austin. And I just try to say, you know, like, you got this one. You know, this is your tournament. Right. They always point right at Sonics. They always go, Nah. What about that? <laughs> you're like, oh, you mean the massive, towering top 10 in the United States threat that we have? Possibly ten, top 10 in the world? Yeah. I, I, bro, I would st die on that hill, say so Sonic's is top 10 in the world. I mean, he's Look got, at his major's performances, man. He's, he's got to keep grinding. And the people he's done it against. He's got to do oh, it. Oh, MVD, please. He needs a stage. Ugh. Bounces him off the side of the stage with the boot, man. Do you tech those? Do you tech those? Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess. Do you tech those? A, a lot of the good things that come from Vegas Smash, like the scene in general, is the fact that they teach you how to DI and they teach you how to tech day one. You know, wow. you're, you're not going to last in the scene. But Vin misses the tech there and finds himself on the other edge of more grenades. Knight comes out. But he grabs him through it. I think he got a little bit of the damage from it. That could help him out. Doesn't get the F smash that he wanted. And now he's fighting to just get stage presence against this snake. Fighting tooth and nail for the opportunity to send MVD to the sky. A little bit of just 
dropped pressure sometimes by Ven. It seems he has the opportunity to get something off on MVG, but MVG just kind of blows right by. We're also just not seeing a lot of that Phantom Knight uh, presence that he Ven can't, is so the well. The second he tries to do it, he gets hit with a nade or something. Getting naded in the nads. Okay. Nice Vance. F smash there on the red side of the Pokeball to get the first stock taken off of MVD, which you definitely need to do in this long best of five that we're going to have ahead of us. Yeah, Counter is his friend here. I feel like it doesn't work on all the moves, but go to sleep, wake up, taste my boot. MVD sitting one stock away from going 2-0 in this best of five winner semis. Ooh, Look, looking yeah. poised and prepared to do so, but then looking to find some way to silence the MVD train. I mean, there's 75% on this cat. He's looking to follow that tech very well, but not going to get it. Ends up getting exploded by his own grenade. I, I don't know how to say this, but I'm just not seeing a lot of mash out of Ben. I don't know if that's the plan or what. Yeah, but like a win with the least amount of buttons pressed. <laughs> that would be, that'd be fire. I mean, it teaches you what's important, what buttons are important. Well, the, the Wing Chun of Smash. He just he just jabbed out a grenade and then tried to do it to another nade and the one blew up on him. So Inconsistencies here from Vin is what's going to lead to his demise. 2-0 on the board for the youngin. And honestly, the backward cap is gone. That's a huge factor, perhaps. Like, we've seen Ash do the forward hat, then go side hat, then go backwards hat. We've never seen him just take it off. Just take it off? What? Oh, and give it to Pikachu. We Only when him. he, like, dies. Yeah. <laughs> like, if he actually, like, ate a full flamethrower by enemy Charizard. I watched one the other day where he, like, threw it to Pikachu, and the Pikachu did, like, a move with the hat on, and I was Ooh, like, yo, that's kind of swaggy. The Ash Cat Pikachu, yeah, bruh. Hey, bro. yo. Yeah, that's, that's a Z move, I think. Alola. Ooh. Okay, grabs it. There's some mash coming out. There's some more. Nice rollout. Counter is his friend here, in my opinion. MBD just looking so poised. You think, you think, multi, you think multiverse buff or, well, it's different buttons, yeah? Oh, you can say he's still. Get, the worst part for me, he gets to still play multiverses. No. You already know. No. Yeah. Definitely. Going over an MVD sound. Definitely. I'm dying, bro. I'm he's still playing. Lie. Just don't talk about it. Okay, my bad. Because he's, he, he's one of the true alpha testers, one of the pros, like Boyd and them. Yeah, that's true. Damn, I'm dying. Goes for the nothing, <laughs> but go back to sleep. I like that. Mashes off the, the stage and then makes it back. Good stuff from Vin there. The mashed potatoes paying out dividends with the back air. It meets the sweet chin of the princess. Link is going to have a couple of choice words for this Snake. solid operator. Real. Of the Metal Gear. And then, he, and then he's going to pull out a rocket launcher and, he's gonna, and, and Link's going to be like, oh, whoa. <laughs> no words, just <laughs> shocked shocked Link face. <laughs> or whatever noise he makes. No, he doesn't make any. Oh. <laughs> MVD's going to make it back to stage here. Well, gonna, those were probably the three or the four worst Link impressions. <laughs> nah, that was pretty good, dude. <laughs> ever done, brother, on live mic. <laughs> 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 On that one. <laughs> <laughs> we're, try we're trying up in here. My guy reaching for the stars, and you're not uh, Woody, my guy. Uh, it's back. But Mortar reaching down to the depths of the stage. Just just the onslaught of projectiles How coming out many from. Projectiles, bro. <laughs> my guy, Ben, feels like he's playing a rhythm game the way he has to <laughs> dodge it. all of these obstacles put in his path. MVD putting the pro in projectile, dude. Holy. It's like a whole obstacle course. And he's hopping around with it, too. Nade here, nade there. Everywhere, nade, nade. Oh, old McDonald had a snake. Ooh, he perfect, perfect parries. parries his own. <laughs> what is happening? Oh, okay, it was just a grenade. Okay. That's, that's a bit more predictable. I thought it was the C4 explosion. I was like, hey. I thought he was trying to get the double on the He C4. actually does know the perfect time of every C4 he places, though. He looks at the time and knows the amount of minutes, seconds, and knows on the timer what time it's going to explode. Time for you to get a watch. Yeah, Don't said, believe me, just watch. Ooh. He said you couldn't even Apollo this Kage. Ooh. Bear. Okay, Spot wait, th dodge. this one's a lot closer, even though it's the last round for Vin. Dealt the deal. Win or get into the schloozers bracket. Yeah, it's win or losers for Vin, and we'll oh, see I that if was he's it. able to get it. Yeah, great up air there to connect. Does send MVD towards his death, but 
not there quite yet. Bit of distance now created. Din's Fire going to reach the mid-level distance that MVD sits at with time being 46 to 86. 56 as the dash attack connects through it. And 11% racked oh. up onto MVD will mean that he sits closer and closer to death, but will he find the oh, kill? He finds the... That's Fair. so nasty. That's so nasty. Nikita gonna get shielded. Nay gonna get shielded. The knight is on the ledge. Push me to the ledge. And finally, Vin gets some leeway, some slack right. in the cord. Beautiful stuff. MVD definitely could have gotten that one. He, I don't think he's gonna be sh uh, shooken off of that at all. It was very close match, and Vin just happened to get that patented back air and MVD always getting that pack in, uh, patented up tilt so right. I, don't I don't think he's upset about that one right a little bit of a does get a counter a pick of his stage even though the counter picks got nerfed <laughs> for MVD but they're just gonna go right back to it PS2 one of the best selling consoles of all time in a map counter not doing it there neutral gonna give it to him Nade gets thrown up in the air. Neutral gonna give him another one. Seems to be not ready for these neutrals right now. Just coming out at the right timing. Grenade gonna trade. Ooh, Vin getting paid. Ooh. Ooh. Vin throwing the shade. Ooh. Get an A grade. Ooh. Try to get paid. Yeah. Ooh. MVD. Getting kind of schmixed on while I drop my mixtape. Vin. That mortar. Hello. I can't believe that hit. Oh, and he's doing counter after counter, bag after bag. Wait a second. Vin kind of finding his rhythm here. Absolutely doing so. Oh, big bag. Oh. Nate not going to hit. Lifts him up. Vin letting MVD come at him. He's got to now, right? But probably shouldn't press the issue. Every time he's walked in, he's dealt a bad hand of cards. You're not loading anything up except this Nikita. I'm driving. Oh, man. Gets back thrown for his troubles. Getting a master class in DI from these two the past few exchanges, but MVD sits with a whole stock behind. He tries to chase it out, but yeah, exactly. That's the get up attack. He's pushing him right into it. Oh, it's kind of moving right now. Off the ledge. Can't land on it because there's a grenade there. MVD can't land on the ledge because it's my toes there. Ten toes to the ground. MVD looking to get 150 extra credit here as uh, he is down at least a stock at the moment. Yeah, definitely sits with the deficit and the dash attack. Just one proc of it almost kills. Directional, this is the definition of directional input. I can influence which way I go oh. due to the directional input. I push on my Smash Bros. player. That is mm -hmm. crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Mathematical. To live at 170 there is crazy. Um, the fact that MVD's down after winning the first two only goes to prove that Vin is all in his bag and downloaded a little bit of the situation. Very hard to download MVD, but if he's playing predictable, it, it kind of is. I wouldn't say he's ever playing predictable, though, so. Yeah, not the type of player that just will sit there and slam his head against a brick wall. He's going to make sure he's climbing over under, walking around if he can, but just here, he's finding that brick wall hits way too hard too and too quick. Two to two, Osti. This could be a sneaky win. Man, I already told Vin. you this one was going the distance. From if you want to run it back from the beginning, I knew it was going to be the long set between these two. I've seen it time and time again. MVD uh, this time starting out with the lead, and Ven with the perfect response. They both have two O's in their pockets, but who wins the best of one? For real, uh, I don't think he's got a three stock on his under order. They both, I mean, they both did it to get here, so we'll see. Nice early coming out, getting first blood from Vin. But we very well see this exact same matchup again and win a Grand Finals. And the fact that they just keep going PS2 too is so crazy. They, these are two, um, these are two great competitors, and they are absolutely appreciating each other's play at the moment because they are sitting 2-2 in a best of five. This is anybody's game right here.
Yeah, you got to be thankful for the competitor that brings you to that point. Shows you that deeper level of your competitive nature. Yeah, just like Goku, right? Like, after he beats you up, he's just like, thanks, man. Thanks for making me so strong. Hey, thanks, bro. <laughs> that was Shout really, out to that Sean. really fun. Shout out to Sean. The only dub actor I'll ever listen to. For real. I was real. Uh, the, the only thing is that the... The Japanese version is actually good. Too, I love like, Grandma Goku. Uh, and, uh, yeah, for real. Grandma and, Goku's uh, elite. And, uh, Frieza 2, he be, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it's Frieza. not the same. Frieza, Frieza 2, he be. Oh. Okay. But, yeah, no, we can't get on track at all. We got a bunch of ballers out here going for the throat here on yeah. Pokemon Stadium 2. It's crazy that. They, they hire us to do this, and we only talk about Smash like 25% of the time. We're talking about music and anime, but I know that's what the people want to hear. Snake's going to glide down. Still, no one has taken a stock here. You know what they say. Gets the people going. Oh, yeah. It's provocative. <laughs> Ball so hard. That shit great. Um, but, yeah, we got more one-hit situations than we probably want to right now for these players. Oh, Up B teleporting through space and time to get that hit on you, MVD. Yeah, event basically playing Paluteno with a hitbox the way this teleport has been utilized today. Oh, okay, the night. setting it up. Backboard alley-oop. Got something going on. I just love how Vin throws in like some new tech every time we see him, it feels like, doesn't it? Absolutely. Like He's always working on some new stuff. He was working on the Sora, and then he comes back with this Zelda that's got new moves, and it's just so important to be that way because MVD cannot find a way inside, and he sits now with the two-stock deficit on yeah. this Zelda, who has the two games in a row, basically seeing a 3-0 coming out. He gets his mortar uh, projectile countered, and now he is 28. He tries to get a perfect parry up tilt, doesn't get it. Yeah, thought Ben would pass through, but he's not on that side. MVD, he's right behind you, racking up insane amounts of damage. But that up tilt from the side of the other side of the world will connect. I've never seen MVD in this situation where a trade will actually hurt him. So he's going to start to play back a little bit more, I think, here. Yeah, he has about 50% to give away before he's in at death's door. So he has to be so smart about this. I mean, he could die right now to something from Zelda. Some of these moves that Zelda's been putting out are pretty crazy. I like what MVD's doing. He's approaching like a snake, like a viper, right? Just coming out for that one or two hits and then kind of backing up. Nice nade. A little bounce off the top. Oh okay. my, Atlanta, the okay, Nikita seen, actually does it. We've seen MVD live to 200 before, um, but I don't think that you can do that against Vin Zelda. So it's, if it's going to happen, it's going to have to happen right now. And Vin is probably not going to just let it happen. Knight comes out and the game starts stuttering. Vin looking like he is dodging raindrops. Yeah. And he gets oh. in beneath the skin of MVD, oh. finds the timing, gets the up. B and gets the connection, gets game five after a tumultuous trial that MVD put before him. Let's go, man. That was a come from behind. Sheesh. Big